What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to Ben's with Jim. As you can see, we're continuing Game of Thrones. Uh, this is going to be season one, episode two, The King's Road. Uh, before we get into this, let's, uh, uh, if you guys want to see the full reaction, my Patreon link is down below. If you guys want to see the next episode, I'm trying to keep my Patreon like episode ahead. So if you guys want to see episode three, go to my Patreon. And uh, yeah, um, no, let's talk about it. Uh, last episode ended on a little cliffhanger. Uh, Jamie Lannister pushed uh, Bran out of the uh, window. Well, not just a window though, like off the tower. So like that, like a high, you know what I mean? Um, and I just got a feeling that like they're gonna get away with it. <laughs> like I don't know why, I just got a feeling that they're gonna get away with it, and it's kind of irking me. But like I don't even know yet, <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> um. Ned Stark decided to go with King, so like uh, that that's interesting. I didn't think he would, but he, you know, what I mean, he felt like he's best at heart to like, you know, what I mean, protect him, and I respect that decision. You know, what I mean, I, I don't think his wife's gonna respect that. Um, a lot of you guys are saying that we're cutting out like the wrong scenes. It's kind of hard for me to know like what scenes to keep, what scenes not to keep, because like this is my first time watching it, so like I don't even know. You know what I mean? So if I cut out a scene, I apologize, but like I. I don't know, like, if it's that important at the time. <laughs> Until y'all tell me. And it's too late by then if, if you guys, uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to get around that. So, yeah. Um, what else is there? Uh, a lot of you guys that call me Sweet Summer Child. What does that mean? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't get the reference. I tried to, I should have looked it up, I guess. But I thought I'd just ask y'all in person. Like, y'all can let me know in the comments. Because a lot of the comments are saying Sweet Summer Child. And you can help me out with that. Um... My friends try to explain to me what winter is coming is mean, but they just confuse me even more. So if you guys know what that like that phrase, let me know. It's probably a comment, and I probably just missed over it. Like someone probably explained that to me, but like let me know again. Uh, yeah, this interest kind of long. Let's get into this reaction. Um, <laughs> the name of this episode is "The King's Road." Hit the like button, subscribe, turn notifications on, and let's get into this reaction. You need to drink, child. Oh, she looks all kind of awful. And eat. Isn't there anything else? In the shadow lands beyond the Shire. They say there are fields of ghost grass. Murders all other grass. The Dothraki believe that one day it'll cover everything. That's the way the world will end. It'll get easier. This must still work, but the dark. We're starting to get married. I missed it. What does Khaleesi mean? Master Lirio has extended his hospitality. You'd be more comfortable there. I have no interest in hospitality or comfort. What did Ned Stark want you for? Buying from a slaver? Selling to one. Some poachers I caught on my land. Under my reign, you won't be punished for such nonsense. I didn't know he was wanted by Ned Stark. What the heck? You gotta stop drinking, because how he end up there? Better looking bitches than you're used to, Uncle. Before you go, you will call on Lord and Lady Stark and offer your sympathies. The boy means nothing to me. Oh, I can't stand the wailing of women. Do you understand? You can't. <laughs> do you just understand? Do it. At this point, goodness gracious. If he forgets, be a good dog and remind him. <laughs> Time for breakfast. <laughs> Little brother. Beloved siblings. Maester says the boy may live. Yeah, they don't like that news. Well, even if the boy lives, it'd be a cripple. A grotesque. Give me a good, clean death any day. I have to disagree. I hope the boy does wake. I'd be very interested to hear what he has to say. Mm. Does he know something? Yeah, brother. I feel like he knows. I lost my first boy. Little blackhead beauty. He was a fighter, too. It's the last thing you need to hear right now. I pray to the mother every morning and night that she return your child to you. Is she lying? Perhaps. I got a feeling they're going to get away with this. It's going to piss me off. Let me thank you ahead of time. You're guarding us all from the perils beyond the wall. Wildlings and white walkers. And oh, he's going through the wall? I'm grateful. It's about the good. Strong men like you protecting us. You've guarded the kingdoms for 8,000 years. Is it? We already? In my regards to the Night's Watch, it's only for life. 
Oh, like once you're there, you can't leave. Type. I think about it again. I ain't gonna hold you. Nymeria, gloves. Impressive. Shut up. <laughs> I have something for you. Oh, is that sword for her? This is no toy. First lesson. Sticking with the pointy end. I know which end to use. Careful. Keep it real. Yeah, I almost, I almost cut my boy. Dancer can keep her sewing needles. I've got a needle of my own. I'm going north with Uncle Benjamin. I'm taking the black. I want you to leave. She's so rude. I get it. Not her son, but come on. Came back a year later with another woman's son. And now you're leaving again. You do have a choice. And you've made it. I get what she's trying to do. She not sure of her son and her husband leaving. He said goodbye to Bran. He's not going to die. I know it. Two Starks are hard to kill. Next time I see you, you'll be all in black. It was always my color. A farewell, Snow. And you, Stark. I think he said goodbye to everybody except for uh, Sansa. Santa? Santa? The Starks have manned the wall for thousands of years. And you are a Stark. You might not have my name, but you have my blood. The next time we see each other, we'll talk about your mother. I could be tripping. Must have been a rare wench to make Lord Eddard Stark forget his honor. You never told me what she looked like. No, will I? I swear if I weren't your king, you'd have hit me already. First thing about your coronation, I get to hit you again. <laughs> I like their relationship. Targaryen boy crosses with a Dothraki horde at his back. The scum will join him. He will not cross. And if by chance he does, we'll throw him back into the sea. There's a war coming, Ned. I don't know when, I don't know who we'll be fighting, but it's coming. At least he's probably not to see that coming, because it is. That dude is definitely trying to start something. The brother, I mean. Castration or the wall? Most choose the knife. Why was that so casual? He like he didn't want to be there. My father was the hand of the king for 20 years. Until your brother killed that king. My sister married the new king. My repulsive nephew will be king after him. Well, my brother has his sword and I have my mind. And a mind needs books like a sword needs a whetstone. Oh. It actually made mad sense. Fire. You stay here, I'll come back. You're not supposed to be here. No one's supposed to be here. He's dead already. No! What the heck? <laughs> oh, that's the that's the brand's wolf. Protect. Okay. They trained their uh, wolves right, didn't they? Goodness gracious. The trader from Karth told me the dragons come from the moon. The moon? Leave me with her. <laughs> she liked her story better. <laughs> How old were you? I was nine when my mother sold me to the pleasure house. Nine? I did not touch a man for three years, Khaleesi. Twelve? Can no. you teach me how to make the call happy? Yes. Will it take three years? No. Welcome. Oh, that's the wall? Oh, the first um episode when they were walking out that little tunnel thing. That's what that is. What's she investigate? What I am about to tell you must remain between How does she know to look? I don't think Bran fell from that tower. I think he was thrown. Someone tried to kill him twice. Why murder an innocent child? Unless he saw something he wasn't meant to see. The Lannisters are involved. I don't want the Lannisters to know I'm coming. Let me accompany you at least. I have prayed to the Seven for more than a month. Bran's life is in their hands now. Yo, a lot of this was kind of crazy how it's adding up. Now her mind instantly went to, like, why was my child to... That's crazy. I did not think about that way. Like someone sent that dude there as a well, 
obviously the Lannister sent him. And plus, she should be okay knowing that, like, as long as that dire wolf is there, Brad, Brad is good. You know what I mean? You're not gonna try it again. No, Khaleesi. She oh. you care how to have. That's what's happening King's here. Trouble. You will make him like it, Khaleesi. Men want what they've never had. And the Dothraki takes slaves like a hound takes a bitch. Are you a slave, Khaleesi? Slave. She is teaching her how to have sex. Okay. If he wanted the Dothraki way, why did he marry you? Damn. <laughs> a lot of good points to be made in this movie. I mean, this movie, this TV show. Ajaline Hazam Shahara. This whole time she can speak what they're speaking? Or does she just start learning this? I don't tell us where we are anymore. I like that from the first episode. Does the hound frighten you? Away with you, dog. You're scaring my lady. Come walk with me. Stay, lady. She named her as lady? Butcher's boy who wants to be a knight, eh? Pick up your sword, butcher's boy. Let's see how good you are. Stop it! Arya, stay out of this! You just cut the three of them. Oh, shit. We're stopping both of you! You're spoiling it! You're spoiling everything! You little cunt! Don't mess with Arya. Arya, leave him alone! She's gonna throw in the water. <laughs> I respect it. Should have left her alone. Don't touch me. Ain't nobody fought with his own. Nah, I ain't gonna hold you. They, they, they dire wolves are like rat or die. Arya! Oh, is Arya hiding too? Arya! Why was my daughter not brought to me at once? How dare you speak to your king in that manner? Quiet woman. Where's your other daughter, Ned? In bed asleep. Sansa, come here, darling. Don't tell me Sansa took his side. She better not have lied for this boy. But I don't know. I don't remember. Everything happened so fast. Yeah. Why is she lying? You let that little girl disarm you. We found no trace of the dire wolf, Your Grace. No. We have another wolf. He doesn't mean lady, does he? Duh, you should never <laughs> No, lie. not lady. He's a blazer, was a lady! Is this your command? Your grace? She should Stand never up. lie. I can't really feel bad for something, because why would you lie? Even though the wolf had nothing to do with it. Dang. Maybe he'll let it go. The butcher's boy. You wrote him down. He ran. Not very fast. He killed the butcher's son. He didn't even touch that boy. I'm not gonna look. That's messed up. Is he about to wake up? I think he killed lady his brain gonna wake up like, like some type of like. <laughs> It's like he's man. It's like he sensed it or something. That's weird. <sighs> so that was episode two. There's there's a lot to uh, talk about. Um, uh, let's just talk about like what we saw at the end. Why well, I keep le leaving off, leaving us on like uh, little cliffhangers. I guess to keep because want to watch it more. But like they're doing such a good job already. Like you know what I mean. People are gonna watch it again. But anywho, so it felt like uh, as if like Brand sensed that lady was about to get killed or something. It was immediately at the, the tsh, his eyes opened right up. That was crazy, but um, uh, it's kind of hard to feel bad for Sansa because, like, why would you lie? You know what I mean? Like, not only did you get your wolf killed, but you got the butcher boy killed. Like, if you just told the truth, but you know what I mean? She, I guess she's somehow falling in love, even though they barely talk to each other. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, man, that that that's all crazy. Um. I can kind of see starting like a little strain between the king and Ned a little bit. Like he, he's forced him to do some things that he didn't really want to do. Like first of all, he kind of forced him to leave, even though he said it was his choice. It really wasn't his choice. He had to let go. You know what I mean? Um, and then the situation with Sansa and Arya and uh, I can't remember the little boy name. Speaking of the little boy, the prince or whatever. Uh, that whole the whole Lannister clan, they're all liars. Like something's wrong with the, this family. Like. The um, Jamie and I can't even remember her name. They're doing some things behind the king's back, even though they're related. Disgusting. Then uh, they did what they did to Bran. 
I'm assuming they're the ones that sent that dude to uh, try to kill Bran when he was asleep. My thing is that, like the. Uh, it felt like when uh, what's her name, bro? When she went and talked to Cat, the print, the the queen. Um, it seemed like she was trying to like get her to leave Bran there. You know what I mean? And then the dude shows up like later on that night. Like it just kind of like correlates together. I wasn't piecing it together until she literally said it. Like, why would they send someone? You know what I mean? Like that was crazy to me. Uh, crap. What I was gonna say. Yeah, man. Uh, Sansa lied got that butcher boy killed because like no one's gonna believe the butcher. You know he didn't touch that dude. I never was gonna believe him over like him, you know what I mean? Cause like, who was he to, you know what I mean? But at least with like Arya, her pops is like his right hand, so like, you know what I mean? That, right there. Um, for Sansa to lie though, like she's literally becoming a Lannister. Like maybe she deserves to be with them. <laughs> I don't know. I'm nervous for uh, uh, Lady Stark, Cat, to be uh, traveling on the road with that one person. I just don't. I, I don't know. It kind of seems like they're all splitting up. You got Jon Snow going to the wall. Rob stays. Winterfell. Cat is like traveling to uh, wherever Ned is, I believe. And then you got Ned, Arya, and Sansa there. Who am I forgetting? <laughs> I'm forgetting somebody. But there's just there's just a lot going on in these first two episodes. I don't even know. I think uh, Drogo. The, the the Thraki dude, I think he just fell in love <laughs> with uh, Daenerys or Khaleesi. Why do they call her Khaleesi? Like, is that what the name you get like after you marry into that? I don't know. You guys gotta let me know. Or maybe that's their, like, their queen name in a sense, maybe? I don't know. Um, But yeah, great episode overall, though. Now I kind of, like... Bran can't really move, so like, how does he get like the word out to people? Like, they had his way for somebody to come in the room, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, great episode. Um, if you guys want to see his full reaction, the uh... wow, the, the link is down below on Patreon. Um, stay tuned for uh, episode three. Hit the like button, subscribe, and turn your notifications on. Peace.